Okay guys, how you doing out there? My name is Kenneth Bird. I'm the creator of Crystal Edge Technology Projection Screens using smart technology gain. Also the inventor of the Fusion Silver, Fusion Black, and Invisible 4K Tech. These are Crystal Vision Projection Screens or Fixed Frame Screens. Alright, so this is what I want to share with you guys really quick. Um, we're going to be doing a demonstration against the DMP Supernova. I do like this screen. You know, I, I like all the different um, demonstrations I get to do against some of these amazing um, screens. This is a side-by-side -side demonstration. And as I said in our demonstrations, we do tests that other screen paints and projection screens won't do because they shy away from the light. They don't do well in the light. And the reason why they don't do well in the light is because you can see in our demonstrations, they will hide the screen as much as possible when it comes to the light. Even when they're actually hitting the screen with the light, you won't see the kind of lighting that we have in our environment. This is the lighting I have in my environment. It is rare that you may see one of these screen paints doing a demonstration with this much light in the environment. And mind you, my screen is not a small screen. It is seven, sorry, eight feet high. I'm thinking about the old screen, eight feet high, 17 feet wide. So there is no way for this screen to hide from any form of ambient light whatsoever in this room. There's Batman over there chilling with armor Batman. All right, so. We're going to do a demonstration of Tinkerbell. Somebody sent me an email uh, on doing a demonstration on a large scale with Tinkerbell. And also, too, what a lot of these guys don't understand is the larger your screen gets, the more pixelations actually expand on the screen. And that basically causes the screen to lose some visibility. Um, that's why people are asking when you do demonstrations, do them on larger scales. Now, the smaller the screen, the better the visibility is going to be. So that's why we do small scales. We'd hit the screens with tons of ambient light. We use low grade projectors just to make it the challenge a lot harder. So we're going to be using the DMP Supernova right here. This is their infinity screen. And mind you, the screen of a Supernova is around the price. Uh, that's what they charge, but that's the price of their screen is three thousand to four thousand dollars just for a hundred inch. Now my screen in here is about 200 inches. Do you want to know how much it costs for a supernova at 180 inches? Somewhere in the range of 16 to 18 thousand dollars. 1900, 16 to 18 thousand dollars. We have a kit that's available on our website on Monday. We call it the 4K Ultimate. It's a two-gallon kit. It will paint a screen in the range of 200 to 400 inches. 180, 200 to 400 inches. All right. So that gives you an idea right there. Now. I want to make a fast announcement here to Mr. J. Okay, um, that's the name we've given him. It's Mr. J over here. Mr. J. Um, we just Jamie, but Mr. J. We're going to call you Mr. J out of respect. Um, we don't. Um, you can send us emails. We don't read your emails. Uh, we take your emails and uh, actually the other day they took your email and they put it in the junk department and they blocked it. So we don't read your emails because we have no interest in reading anything you have. We're not bothered by the little dinky videos that you do about, you know, you know, slandering our product. We don't because I can come in here and I can take my screen and I can put it under a ton of ambient light. I can test it against some of the best screens on the market and my screen will look fantastic. But I'll see in your demonstrations that you don't do anything close to our demonstrations. And I do love it how people will talk about us, but yet they won't do the same demonstrations that we do find that kind of funny. So anyway, um, your email account has been blocked. So we don't, we're not really, we don't really care about what you have to say or what you have to do. I explained to you before and I'll explain to you again and anybody else, we have contracts now. We, uh, we do business outside of YouTube. Um, we have companies that are, we're doing business. We have, con I mean, I've got a contract I got to send today, which I completely forgot I got to send a contract today. But anyway, um, yeah, we have, we have reach. We, have, we do things differently, so we're no longer in the small pond fighting for fish food or whatever it is we're fighting a pond for. We, um, we're on a, another level, so we don't care. The only thing you could possibly do that could pretty much get yourself in trouble is to basically copy my formula and start making it. I mean, because a lot of you guys out there want to think that, oh, this is impossible. You can't, you can't copyright and you can't patent a, um, a chemical. Yes, you can. Yes, you can, and 
You don't want to find out the outcome of that for tampering with somebody's patent or copyright. Just want to put that out there, okay? So anyway, let's move on because we have things to do and I have a lot of things to do, Mr. J. I don't have time to be going on and on with you about this, but I wish you the best of luck on your venture and a word of advice. Stop hating on other people. Concentrate on your own, what's going on in your own backyard. My friend, my dad used to say, never worry about what's going on in somebody else's backyard. Worry about what's going on in your backyard. So that's what you need to do. Concentrate what, on what you need to do. You have potential. You can, I see you acting like a, I don't know, a town jester. I feel sorry for you. I really do. And you know what? You have potential. You do. You really have potential. And RN, there's no hatred for you. We don't hate you. But, you know, the way you carry yourself makes yourself look very unprofessional. So, on our end, like I said, you have very, you have good potential. You do. It's just the way that, and, and direction that you're using your energy for is just not going to work out too well for you. All right, so let's move on now. Um, we have over here uh, the sample sheet of the Supernova. I'm tired. I have a lot of work to do. A lot of work to do. So, there's a sample sheet of Supernova, as you guys have seen. I'm going to put it against the screen right here. That's going to be my last address on this matter. I got work to do. I got so much work to do, it's not even funny. So that's my last address on this matter. We don't pay you any mind. We have work to do. It's Super Bowl and here I am working. Alright, and let's get this started. Alright, so we'll start the movie. Oh, should we turn out the lights? Nah, we keep the lights on. For now, I'll keep them off for now. Okay. Make sure everything is playing correctly. I think you put the Lord of Winter. All right. All right, guys. You ready? All right. Just gonna make sure everything is set up well. All right. So there's my screen. Fully lit environment. There's a supernova right in the center of the screen. Tell me what you see. Picture quality looks absolutely incredible. Now mind you, my screen's at 200 inches. A 180 inch supernova is easily going to cost you 16 to 17 thousand dollars. A 100 inch will cost you in the range of three to four thousand dollars. This is the Crystal Witch technology screen. Look how amazing this screen looks. Fully lit environment, plenty of light in the environment. I can have my nieces and nephews, they can come over here, sit down here, watch the movie, eat a little popcorn, have some fun. And we can do this in a fully lit environment. No partial lit, no, no uh, um, what do you call it? ambient light controlled environment, none of that nonsense. We don't have to go through that over here. This is the luxury you get from a Crystal Edge technology screen. Look how beautiful that looks. 190 degree viewing angle. Mm, look at that. With the lights on. There is the supernova right there. Now we got a two gallon package, like I said, we got a two gallon package called the Ultimate 4K or 4K Ultimate that will allow you to paint a screen size, I mean a massive screen size of 200 inches all the way up to 400 inches. The ratio sizes for this screen will be a 4.3 to 16, 9, 16, 10, 239.1 or 235.1, 239.1. Let's come up the stairs and show you even from the top angle, the screen looks incredible. Look. No fading, no washing out. Absolutely fantastic. All right, you guys, I'm gonna take out the lights. Let's hit the lights. Watch the screen explode. See, this is how amazing our technology is. Fully lit room. Did the room a fully lit room. My nieces and nephews come over and see this screen. They have a ball. As their eyes get huge dinner plates and they're just gazing at this. Right, come back over here. Turn on my uh my light. Watch that smart technology game kick in. Okay, 
Let's do another scene. This particular scene here, I really love. It's a snow scene. Really like it. Alright, there we go. That sky blue, the color I chose with this looks incredible. I have a little light in here. Okay guys, I'm Kenneth Burr from Crystal H Technology Projection Screens using Smart Technology Gain. Hope you guys enjoyed this video demonstration on our amazing screen paints. Now mind you, our screen paints come in one quart, two quarts, three quarts, uh, no, sorry, one quart, Ooh, messed up there for a minute. One quart, two quarts, we had a three quart kit. One quart, two quarts, the one gallon, and now we have the two gallon, which is the 4K Ultimate. Look at this. I'm gonna play a little bit more of this. Tell me, look at the color. Tell me how gorgeous that freaking looks. take the supernova off. There's no point in having this on the screen anymore. Let's remove that and then watch this whole thing got the supernova on it. Look at that. Ooh, that looks amazing, doesn't it? My niece saw that. If she came over here, she's going to come over here later on the day, but if she saw that, her eyes would just go, oh my goodness. Never seen Tinkerbell on that scale. Okay guys, hope you enjoyed the video demonstration. Thank you all for watching. I got work to do. I'm um, gonna try to watch a little bit of the Super Bowl, but like I said, I have things to do. Hope you guys enjoyed the video demonstration. Like I said, this is no way to slander Mr. J in any way. Um, it's just basically just to let him know that we don't care. We don't. You know, I have, my company's doing well, contracts are going well, you know what I mean? My product looks amazing. We don't care, it doesn't bother us. I mean. We wish you the best of luck. I really do. All right. On that note, we have to go. Bye-bye.